Yeah, yeah. yeah that's typical, yeah. isn't it? What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and today we're going to be reacting to the M4 CSL record lap on the Nürburgring. It's been released on the BMW M YouTube channel, 536,000 views, so let's get straight into it. This Sunday, 10.30, somebody will be winning this BMW M140i for 99p. It's got full service history with 26,000 miles on the clock, finished in alpine white, stays to tuned to over 450 horsepower, has double slatted kidney grills, a gloss black body kit with M3 style mirrors, and to finish it off, it's been lowered on gloss black 18 inch alloys. So just to remind you, this Sunday, 10.30, somebody will be winning this car for 99p. Head over to llfgames.com for your chance to win. Never green, fast lap. Wow. CSL, I will take you. That is really high, isn't it? Lap. First left hander. A little bit early in the start. Wow. Take the wow. Tires not perfectly yeah, warm. It's moving, isn't it? Down to Hudsonbach. Wow, look at the front end. It looks lovely. Use the full space. Break Bro, it sounds fast. It sound. Three. Accelerate out full. Wow, look at him on the power. Here. Left handers. Almost full. Yeah, we can use the curb or so at the exit. Spot Cup to our tires. That is holding on, boy. Watch the exit. That's up to that. Uh, He's always in the right power band, isn't he? You know, some people like to be a gear up just to pull the power through, but I'm a guy. I like to be in the right gear every single time. Bro, this thing is flying. He's, he's tame and it's a bit of a pig, like. Or should I say, he's just driving the hell out of it, of course. Wow. Wow. It's got that CSL vibe to it, hasn't it? Like the M3 CSL. Bro, he's doing 280 kilometers, man. Settle down you know, again. He's flying. Carbon ceramics. Carrying that speed through, boy. 130, 40 mile an hour. Wow. Again, the exit is. Wow. Bro, the front end bite is unreal. Look at the grip. I'm praying that this is exactly. How the car is like there ain't no little secret mods that have been done, like extra weight taken out. You can see it's not though. Sometimes clips can be speeded up. Bro, I love the Nurburgring, ring, bro. You see me, I love Silverstone, but I love the Nurburgring ring as well. This is like my, this used to be my first favorite track. I need to bust it on uh, the sim rig. Oh, hopefully they got this in i racing. I need to download that. Bro, this car sounds fast. Can you hear how up in the RPMs it is? I'm sure it's eight speed, isn't it? Is it going to be eight speed? Six. Five. Hundred mile an hour through there. Sorry, man. I'm terrible with like like locations of the track, like the name of the corners and stuff. But bro, I can tell you, I know the Nurburgring. Four back to three. Long down section. Wow. Perfect break. Bro, can you hear how up in the RPMs it is? Like every shift. Triple right. Don't turn it too early. It's this drive is very aggressive, isn't it? It's not the smoothest. Sound to be a siphon. Slowest one. On the Overdrive the corner ever so slightly, man. Sometimes are getting into traction wow, problems. the tractions are. Did you say traction problems? Look like full traction out of there. It's almost like it's four wheel drive, isn't it? Part of the track. For the exit. I'm using the third gear. Wow. It's raining out. Wow. See how early he was on the front there? Okay, you know, this thing's flying, mate. Can you believe we've got an M car doing a 7 minute 15 second lap time? Unbelievable. Always been a little bit behind the, uh, the, the Beamers, aren't they? The M cars versus like the Porsches. Long straight part. And I mean, this is probably still behind anyway. The Kesslechen section. Obviously, we've got some cars in the, the six minute yeah, range now. More than 40 kph. Yeah. Bro. 155, 60 mile now. We let up ever so slightly. Bro, that car's moving. Fifth gear. 110. 
perfect exit. 124. Next one is also important. Now, wow. just again. So, to contraction at the exit. Tires are overheating, of course. Carousel. Seven minute lap Here record. Short time. Back to four and three, the carousel. Don't jump out too early. Try to stay in as long as possible. Keep the car straight at the Caught one of these, slap some R triple R's in it, AR1, so you're good. Du Royacht, left hander. Wow so, man. Pull. Crazy, it's heavy as yeah, F totally as well. Look how heavy it is. Late. So heavy car the man. So oh, mad. Section. So we're raving to about 72, 73,000 RPM. Straight about 7 1. Wow. It's not even a perfect lap, is it? I mean. And you have to. Deliver. Of the Connery. See, with these turbocharged M cards, you usually need to be a gear up, yeah. man, because they're so spiky. But look, this looks very controllable. You know, he's staying in the power band on the throttle. Use the space of the exit. So here, you have to sometimes understeer and exit sometimes steer. He's not fighting that bad, perfect but... Perfect tires, perfect. Like if you actually look at him in the uh, in the cabin, looks pretty like, you know, he's not able to do no big catches. Jump. Keep the car straight. Yeah, dodge a bit there, so I love this. Breaking maneuver. Turning Could have definitely went a lot faster through there. That's an exiting gift here. Yeah, there's there's, there's 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 more in this car, literally. Again, there's definitely more. That's great. Fellow S. Not that yeah, guy's like yeah. before anyone starts going. Yeah, or oh, Ricky. Yeah, Not right. like yeah. I don't know. It's just my thoughts. Back to five. Entering. Oh, he's driving an F out of way. Four. Remember, this ain't a racing car. It's like a, it's a road car. They really said good. it's a road car first. Still stable car. Still can. Accelerate very early. Now one of the most important ones, Golden Cup. Brings us back to the long straight. Gear for the exit. Wow. Keeps the car stable. He Keeps knows the Nürburgring, ring man. And then accelerate out. Wow. Six gears. Now I'm staying. Is he going go to seven? Side. Is there an eighth gear? Yeah, there is eight gears. Yeah. Use the space to bring the car. 290 so kilometers. Oh, it's limited. Still no, it's not weight. limited. Turning in on the right side. Bro, he is absolutely flying. Throttle. Very good gauge. Quite good. Quite good. And it's really important in this section. Wow. Last two corners. Wow, man. Trying nice. to avoid any mistakes now. Yeah, that's typical, isn't it? Seven minutes fifty. We're always talking wow. about two left hands. So yeah, that's the M4 CSL. Uh, for anyone that's new to the channel or anyone that's subscribed, I've owned almost every M3. Uh, E36 M3, E46 M3, E92 M3, my missus owns an E93 M3, you know the convertible V8. I've owned the F80 M3 manual, I've owned an F82 M4, I own an M140 right now, I've had plenty of other BMWs. It's good to see that BMW are bringing back the CSL brand, 100%. Bit more power, 100 kilos lighter, 126,000 pounds, a lot of money. Not too sure on the price of the G80 M3s and M4s, I know huge, you can get them for around the 70k mark. This is a driver's car, you know. If you're not into driving, you're not gonna consider a CSL because you're gonna look at the performance and the numbers, or should I say like zero to 60s, top speed and stuff like that, and you're not gonna be interested. But as you can see, seven minute 15 second lap time on the Nürburgring is huge. 15 seconds faster, fastest M car ever. Someone like myself who, I'm not looking for a GT3, but my ideal and ultimate dream daily would be a Porsche GT3. You can genuinely daily drive it and you can then go do track days and spank everything on there. It's nice to know as an M car enthusiast, someone who loves BMs, that there is the equivalent, you know, I'm not sure if it's faster or slower, you're definitely gonna hang there. I'm not sure with a new 992 GT3, but a 991.2, 
that's the kind of car that I ideally would like. So let's read some of these comments. Wow, the M4 CSL is a monster. Congrats on the lap time. This thing is the ultimate weapon. Congrats, guys. I can't wait to see the M3 Touring as well. Yeah, that's going to be an exciting one as well, the M3 Touring. Uh, driven a few of them as well. I'll give one of them away. But anyway, guys, I'm going to end the video there. As always, if you enjoyed it, hit the thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. And link down what you'd like to see me watch next remember tick a link in the description this sunday 10 30 someone's going to be winning that 450 horsepower alpine white m140 uh, so yeah kind of wait to see who wins i'll see you then